were yours, you were flying! Yours, <laughs> you were flying! Oh no. As to last week's events at Arkham Asylum, a spokesperson for the GCPD assured us that the breakout has been contained and all inmates have been returned to their cells. Joker, right? Miss Vale Joker is missing too, right? and presumed yeah. dead following a gruesome battle with the caped vigilante known vigilante? as the Ooh, Batman. Who hired this man? Her death marks the end of Children of Arkham's reign of terror. <sighs> If the public knew the half of it, it's better that they don't. Uh, this came in the mail. It's unsigned. Selena. Alfred, here, l let me help. No, no, don't. With everything that's been going on, I, I, uh, I haven't yet thanked you, Bruce. You've saved my life. I've no doubt Miss Vale would have killed me had you not arrived when you did. But the fact remains, in my state, I'm not of much use to you. It'll take time to adjust, and I'm afraid it may interfere with my butler duties. Without you, none of this would work. You are my family. You don't know how good it is to hear you say that after everything that's happened. I promise you, I will use everything at my disposal to help you. Oh. Well, sure. I mean, the silver's not going to polish itself, is it? <laughs> we will get through this, Bruce. Don't lose sight of the fact that you've done some real good for Gotham. I know, you should bro. be proud. I didn't take them down alone. I had help. You, Lucius, Gordon, Selena. Selena. All right then. And all those You're who gave their bro. life fighting you for Gotham. To the shorty, bro. You know, more, more to those who man. helped, man. and those we lost. The damage done Dang. by the children of Arkham has left Gotham a city in turmoil. Faith in those at the top has perhaps irrevocably been shaken. Acting Commissioner James Gordon has promised to speak out about the issue tonight during an emergency citywide address. And I hope, despite the recent terror that's gripped our city, that Gotham's leading citizens will come out to show their support. Will his token appointment be enough to regain the city's trust? It remains to be seen, but experts agree that 
Gordon requested Gotham's leaders to stand behind him. Leaders like you. <sighs> let Gotham see who Bruce Wayne truly is, and let them know what you plan to do for his future. You ain't, you ain't Alfred. Your first start. For you, and for this city. Though, in Gotham, the only figure that can make as much impact as a Wayne is Batman. You've helped uh, this city Batman. tremendously, both as Bruce Wayne and Batman. And That's that person, I'm whether he dons a cape or not, is someone I'm proud of and honored to call my friend. Uh, you already know me, bro. Just do my job! It's a lot to live up to, you know. I won't let you down, Alfred. I know you won't. So, what do you intend to do about tonight? Well, Lucius has yet to invent a suit that'll let Bruce Wayne and Batman be in the same place at once. That is unfortunate. I suppose you must decide whose appearance will be more valuable. As Bruce, you can help repair the damage done to your name, get the public support so that you can change things from the top down. But Batman is a symbol of justice and strength. Maybe in these dark times, that is truly what Gotham needs the most. Perhaps one is truly the mask. And one is who you truly believe you are. I really took him down as Batman, but so you know. No. Bruce Wayne will be there. You'll make quite the impression. Gordon will be grateful. You know, bro, I gotta fix my name, bro. Get my respect back. I don't care what they deem me as a bat. I know who I am. I'm Batman. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh my god. Commissioner Gordon. He is here. Commissioner Gordon. Yeah, it doesn't sound right. Don't worry. It will. Thank you for having me, Commissioner. Well, to be honest, I was surprised to get your call. Now, after that nasty business at your manor. I know Harvey was a good friend of yours. A loss nah, like that. My dick. I wouldn't blame you for lying low. What you did is no secret. These people all saw there's more to Bruce Wayne than just the playboy. Public <laughs> yeah, opinion is bro. bound to swing around. Well, before long, you'll be Gotham's golden boy again. These people they have no idea who Bruce Wayne really is. It's about to change. Imagine. Oh? Well, I look forward to knowing the real Bruce Wayne as well. Uh, I was half hoping Batman okay. might show up too. <laughs> I wouldn't mind knowing he was keeping be. an eye on things here. He's pretending God. Not to mention, <laughs> he makes one hell of an impression on people. Do so, does this mean you trust the Batman? Uh, to play by my rules? No. But to fight for this city? Hell yes. Hell yeah. They're ready for you, Commissioner. Oh, she really shot up a whole criminal. Now, during and they times let her off like the leash, bro. It can feel impossible to hold on to She hope. was joked up, though, so. Oh. But I have hope. Hope that together we can rebuild what was lost. Now, in the last few I weeks. rebuild my mansion. As much violence <laughs> and terror as I've seen. A lot of damage, my guy. I've also seen the citizens of this community band together to fight those threats. And one of those people is Bruce Wayne. Thank you, Commissioner Gordon. Tough act to follow. <laughs> I'm here today to not only show my support for our acting commissioner, but also for this city. Many of you have suffered terrible losses. And some of those losses came at the hands of my own father. Or at least as a result of his actions. 
no excuse for my father. I would like to take this opportunity to apologize. To tell you how sorry I am for the pain the Wayne family has caused this community. If my recent incident with Harvey Dent has shown me anything, it's that I can no longer sit on the sidelines. My family's wealth was built on the suffering of others. I think it's time to repay that debt. I plan to use my resources to improve the city and make the lives of its citizens better. And to that end, A closer alliance between the GCPD and Wayne Enterprises will provide the police force with the support, with the training, and the equipment they need to make Gotham safer than it ever has been before. The GCPD will be the most technologically advanced police force in the country because the people of Gotham deserve to feel safe. Man's on Batman. Nobody gonna question me how I just knocked him out. <laughs> Bruce Wayne. Bruce Wayne. Get that bastard to lock up. Bruce Wayne. You know me, man. I'm Bruce Wayne. I heard up. Dude, I like, nobody be questioning me like how I have so many moves, bro. Like, I'm Bruce Wayne, bro. I'm Bruce Wayne. Just minutes ago. Bad. Bruce Wayne delivered a rousing speech that turned into a shocking assassination attempt on his life. He sure does clean up well. See you soon, Brucey. <laughs> yeah, this game is pretty good, bro. Sheesh. Of course I did, bro. I'm Bruce Wayne. Did you blame Alfred? Told Alfred it didn't matter. It was what it was. Comfort. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah. As more than a thief, bro. She is more than a thief, bro. She my thief, bro. <laughs> Yo, I was clapping them cheeks, bro. I'm crazy. Did you take off the car? Hell no. Bugging, bro. I gotta protect my identity. Oh, uh, identity. Shut it all love my coming street. Got him. Stop. Um, did you attend? Of place. Oh, of course, bro. Like, I'm Bruce Wayne, bro. Gotta show my. Gotta give me my credit. Show me my Facebook. Like, come on, bro. And plus, Batman and Day? Nah, not a good sight, bro. Not a good sight. <sighs> Compassion. I'm compassionate. What can I say? Merciful? Yes, I'm very merciful. Cunning? <laughs> 60%. Self reliant? You know. <sighs> I'm pretty good, bro. I'm a pretty good guy. You're crazy. You know me, man. I'm pretty good guy. What's the next game, bro?